Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you are new here, I hope you consider subscribing. First of all, I would like to congratulate Miss Alex Gonzaga. Naka 10 million subscribers na siya na. Wow! 174 videos. Kami nga, 300 videos na eh. Okay, yung latest vlog niya ay a few hours ago lang uh, na-upload. At ito yung thumbnail. 40 Shopao in one sitting. S-E-A-T-I-N-G. Okay, so tama ba tong sitting na to? Medyo kagad kong nakita. Today, let's try to see the differences between setting, S-E-T-T-I-N-G, sitting, that's S-E-A-T-I-N-G, and sitting, S-I-T-T-I-N-G. Lahat po to ay nouns. So, by giving you sentences, siguro maiintindihan natin kung ano yung pagkakaiba. Let's try to go to the first one, that is setting, S-E-T-T-I-N-G. I want to live in a beautiful cottage, in a peaceful country setting. Okay, country type of setting. Ano ibig sabihin ng setting dito? It is a place or type of surroundings where something is positioned or yung isang bagay ay nakalugar, nakalagay or where a kind of event takes place like a movie setting okay, setting ng isang um, how do you call this? shooting sa, sa isang taping, halimbawa okay, so yun yung setting it is a place or a surrounding where something is positioned or an event takes place. Yun yung setting. So obviously, dito sa thumbnail niya, hindi pwede yun. Okay. Now, punta tayo dun sa sitting. S-E-A-T-I-N-G. It's coming from the word seat. Ito. Boom. Yung upuan sa Tagalog. I will give you example sentence. Okay. The restaurant has sitting for 80 people. Has sitting for 80 people. Ano iniisip natin doon? Ito po ay yung mga upuan. The seats with which a building or room is provided. Yung mga nakatalagang upuan. Okay, yung capacity, I should say, pwede rin yun. Take note, yung seating ay singular form lang. Kasi the seats with which a building or room is provided. Okay, yung maramihan. Seating ang tawag doon. Pero pag isa lang, seat. Okay, it's a verb and a noun. S-E-A-T. Or chair, kung hirap tayo. Okay, so obviously, tignan natin kung tama yung S-E-A-T-I-N-G. It still doesn't sound correct. Ulitin ko lang ha. Seats with which a building or room is provided. Okay. Now, punta tayo sa number 3, yung seating. That's S-I-T-T-I-N-G. Okay, meron ako ditong chocolates. And um, etong uh, amount of chocolates na to, I can actually eat it or eat them in one sitting. S-I-T-T-I-N-G. Okay, yun yung ibig sabihin ni Alex Gonzaga dito. Because when you say S-I-T-T-I-N-G, it means a continuous period of being seated. Especially when engaged in a particular activity like eating and so on and so forth okay I hope you get the point I hope you see the differences that should be 40 shopao in one sitting S-I-T-T-I-N-G not S-E-A-T-I-N-G you all have a great day if you want to be part of our channel please go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell icon I am teacher them and I was a teacher for quite a long time, say, sa international school, an English teacher. You all have a good day.